Hello there! Welcome back, Agrarian Skies 2 Let's Play series. This will be episode number 68, and I may or may not need to be apologizing <laughs> for episode 67. I still haven't decided if I'm going to put it up. It was a bit slow. Um, there was some good information, so I think I'll end up putting it up. So yeah, the, the slow parts I'm apologizing for now. Anyhow, so what we got going on here is I actually have a plan for today. And that plan for today is going to occur right after I make these or this yellow heart. Because I want to top myself off. And yeah, that all went further smoothly. So let me go make a yellow heart and I'll let you take a peek at my inventory as I'm working on this. And I think maybe you'll figure out what I got in mind. So, um, whoop, 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 whoop. first I'm going to learn to spell. <laughs> All right. So yellow heart uh, canister right there. Do that. And that should top me off. Yeah, get in there. And we go in there and we go in there. And we go there, and that didn't work. So there we go. So we're topped off. And what I'm working on is, as I mentioned in the episode that I almost didn't air, <laughs> I went into the deep dark. And that was last episode. And I decided, I discovered that, yeah, let's. there, there are some minerals in there. There is some stuff in there. So let's go ahead and set up an ender quarry. So I have done some work to put that together here and scrambled around and did all the stuff. Um, the only really tricky part um, for the ender quarry in this particular case was, believe it or not, on the speed upgrades because I needed an efficiency one diamond pickaxe. Well, Everything that was efficiency one that I've gotten for loot, I'd either melted down or thrown away because I didn't really need it. I wouldn't use it. Well, I was wrong. So that was my biggest struggle. I ended up going through and grabbing all, not all of them, but quite a large chunk of the thomium tools that I had in here, axes, hoes, pickaxes, and throwing them in over here and how I eventually got my efficiency one. Um, let me fix the microphone here. How I eventually got my efficiency one was by running it through at an auto enchanter level one. Thaumium is very enchantable and even at level two setting, I was getting efficiency two. Go figure. So I'll throw this all the way back up to 30 where it was supposed to be. Ha -ha. And as you can see, I've got a lot of them in here um <laughs> so yeah that's how that all went together and yeah i got a few more books lots of little uh little level one stuff uh okay so that's going there i'm going to kick the uh ender quarry into into business here i have sextuple and septuple compressed cobblestone I have lots more just cranking through this thing pretty quickly, as you can see. Matter of fact, it's almost moving it faster than it, creating it faster than it can move it out with the standard servo. So I may end up upgrading that. So, um, now what else do I need to do in order to power, oh, the, the upgrades that I'm going to throw on this under quarry are just the standard world hole upgrade. I don't think I'm going to be needing to collect a whole lot of dirt in the for the hoarding. But um, you know what? Just in case, I'm not going to use that. I'm going to go ahead and let it replace everything with dirt. And I'm going to put in a speed upgrade 2, which will give me a 1.5 power multiplier. I'm going to have it do silk touch because I would rather deal with my own um, smelting of, of different and sundry goodies. And I am going to need a power tap, which I'm going to plug right into the side of the... No, <laughs> that's got to go into my reactor so that I can put a tesseract on it because I don't want to change how it is set up for my power swap here. 
and I am concerned because the last couple times I've hit this it's coming back and it's not completely full so I've got to look at my reactor anyhow so let's go take a look at the reactor uh, that's home and that's platform and that will get me there and back once each so let's go up to the platform Bink. now are you charging you are charging now why are you well in that special um, I don't know if you remember but a couple episodes ago when I was working on this I happened to right click on the reactor controller <laughs> with a, <laughs> a recall uh, stone in my hand and it kind of crashed the game and dumped me to desktop and caused my <laughs> recording software to lock up <laughs> well I did it again <laughs> I'm not very bright sometimes <laughs> uh, any side bets on how many times I do this during the course of this season all right here we go um this is now pumping out lots of power and it is charging over here so we are up to 30 million out of 50 which is cool um, we have plenty of fuel in there it still hasn't gone through a second full bucket <laughs> a full unit of 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 power <laughs> yay okay so i'm gonna come over here we're going to punch a little hole in the reactor and that's going to shut it down and cause everything to go you know get all whiny and crying and wah, 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 wah. i'm going to wait for this to finish filling up first but i need to set up a tesseract to feed power and or receive units back devices units <laughs> units <laughs> get my ore and everything else that the that the uh, quarry pulls out there we go okay so let's turn this off deactivate reactor and i'm going to lose all of this charge anyhow so that doesn't really matter too much so let's come over here let's pull that part out and i did get it good let's put a reactor power tap right there and it no it did hold the power good 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 okay so now we're going to put a you right there we're going to create um just that power and we're going to call this channel three and we're going to name that add power and there it is we are on channel three and this tesseract will B, doing nothing with items, nothing with fluids, and sending energy. So we should be golden there. Let's turn it back online. And right now we should be at, whoops, a little too far. Watching this thing put in the control rods. Good, good, good. And so we are golden. Coolness. All right. So I don't need. Why I'm not needing. Okay. I need. Wait a second. And why do I have that one? I shouldn't have an extra one, should I? I don't remember picking up an extra one. All right. Anyhow, let's go ahead and do this and head back down. There we go. Put that away. Just like that. And we have a Tesseract. We have... I'm going to leave the hole upgrade alone. Oh, you know what I haven't done? I have not created the... Um, I have not created the extra utilities markers. And I need to make ender markers. And I need ender infused obsidian to do that. I'm not sure if I have any extras down here. I do. 
good. Okay, so I need markers. Did those go away? And I'm going to need, what is it, two and an ender pearl, and I need at least three. Good. Okay, so let's take this stuff to my quail eating ducks. Quite elegant device. Okie dokies. Whoopie doopy. And you stay there and you go there. And I'm going to let it do that. And I will be right back. Whoopie doopy. Here we go. We have three ender markers. Cool. Now, um, what do I want to do? How do I want to do this? More importantly, um, let's see. I'm going to. All right. I have. Oh, uh, stuff to get rid of. Let's get rid of stuff. Uh, hello. There we go. Let's get rid of stuff. Stuff can go in here. Stuff, 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 stuff. Stuff, stuff. And more stuff. And don't need that. And let's see. I also have the deconstruction table that I have yet to set up. And I'm going to go ahead and put that... Right here. Smack dab in the middle. I think that's in the middle. That's uh, off center just a little bit. <clears throat> but that should be taking advantage of all those crystals. So that should be cool. Let's do a quick little test and throw something in there that is not too important. <laughs> like my crossbow. No! All right. Yeah, Grim Reaper is safe. Let's throw this in there. Bonk. Nope. Maybe it won't take advantage of it. Who knows? Because it is only two away from those crystals. Maybe they need to be above it. Wow. That was spectacularly unhelpful. <laughs> All right. Anyhow. Whoa. Hello. What's left of a tree? Okay. So we have stuff. Uh, I don't need that right now either. So I do need to recharge that. I just realized. I will be right back. Okay, here we go. We are all set. Whoops, and a little wet. <laughs> okay, so hello there. I named the pincushion. <laughs> Alrighty then. Um, let's see. I want... I have my angel blocks. I'm going to need the Grim Reaper. I'm going to need the trash can. I'm going to need an item filter. Uh, actually, I probably should make a couple item filters, but that's fine for now. Um, Ender Quarry upgrade. Don't need the zombie flesh. Um, Ender Quarry. Silk Touch upgrade. The Tesseract to get the power and send the items back. The quarry speed to upgrade, and the angel block, and the ender markers. That should be enough for an initial setup. And I need sigil of the blood lamp as well. Okay, so here we go. Let's go have some fun. Dun dun dun. Okay, so first bit, come over here. And you know what? I'm going to cut this out just a little larger in general because I want to be able to fly up here and be able to stand here for a moment without having to plummet directly down. Alrighty. Almost done, almost done, almost done. Ah! All right. 
Now, how do we want to set this up? I want to do a test run with only a little bit of area covered first. And let's see how that will go. All right. So I need to hit F7. I want to see what my lighting looks like. But it looks like stuff is going to be spawning here regardless of the light level, which is a distinct possibility. And yeah, I know you had enough of this last episode. <laughs> All right, so let's come over here. Whoop, I am too far from too far from light, but and we will fix that right now. So we're going to put you right there, and we're going to put you right there. So that is now lit. Ha <laughs> ha. Now we are going to throw some cobblestone down right here so that we can set this up the way we want it. I want it to go those two directions. And I want... Actually, I'm going to need to do it the other way. I need it right there. So we will put the ender quarry down, just like that. And we will put the silk, uh, silk touch on top and ender quarry speed two on that side. <coughs> and we will put the tesseract think the tesseract is going to go right there and we will set this up to send items and receive energy and we want it on that one so now you have power now let's do this i need to come over here come down here i am at Y93. And I'll put that right there. That right there. Come over to here. Go like that. Put that one there. Pop that. Put a light on that. And put you... Oh, I can't put a light on that. Put that there and I'll put a light on that. There we go. Put it on the side. That gives me two of them, and I think I need to right-click it. Not sure. Okay. Last time I used the Ender Quarry, it was a different method. You used the fences. So this is a slight learning experience for me. Bring this over here. Whoops. Stay in line. Light that up. And do that. And light that up. And do that. And do that. Okay, so that's in line. I think I missed the other one. So let me go fix that. Yeah, you're looking that way. So I must have drifted off of my... Okay, so I need to be on 881. And I bet you I missed it. Oh, nope, it's up too high. <laughs> Close enough. All right. Let's come up here and grab you. Come down here. Do that. Do that. And that. Okay, good. Now, that should work. And if I right-click it. Successfully established boundary. And are you starting to cut? So what's the challenge here? Oh, it's already mining. Where is it mining, though? That's the question. I don't see anything changing. So do I collect these now? I think I do. I don't want them to go poof. There's two. And there is whoop, three. Now, you should be mining somewhere inside of that boundary. 
and relatively close unless I happen to have started directly over I may have mm -hmm. so it should be right nope I'm not seeing it where okay oh you know why it's not doing anything because I don't have a place for it to get rid of stuff yet that's why so let's go back let's go back home hello can I go home now uh, ay, ay. <laughs> can I find it <laughs> uh, I'm lost and I don't know where I'm going all right it's got to be around here am I just blind you're all laughing at me, I know it. All right. There it is. Okay, so I know where it is there. There we go. Oop. Now, let's head up here and head back to the base. Now, let's go see. Whoops, you know what? I'm wondering. No, nope, nope, because I have to pipe out of it first. So let's get you and you. Actually, let's do it this way instead. Put you there. You there. Are you turned on? Turned off? I don't know. Should be good. Oh, power. Select. Receive items. And let's throw that there. Turn you on. I should start getting stuff. Mm, nope. Nope not doing it okay so let me figure out what's going on i think i may need to set up a chest over there at the ender quarry first and then pump stuff into the tesseract let me go take a quick look and i will be right back I think I figured it out. It's not getting any power. So I think I left my Tesseract on my reactor turned off. So I'm going to run up there real quick and check it out. Be right back. And let's see if I can avoid crashing to the desktop again. Yep, that was it. I had it set to low. So that's why it wasn't sending any power. And let's head back home. And get rid of that stone and grab another one and set this one because I have run out of charges on the other one. And get rid of that one. Bonk. All right. So let's come over here. No, you certainly won't be receiving anything because the wireless wire doesn't work. <laughs> oh yeah and here we go charging off into the into the abyss Whoa. all right yeah there we go <laughs> I'm doing okay I'm getting a little too many stone <laughs> So, actually, you know what? I got to do this differently. So, let's grab this and grab this and grab that. Put it there for a moment. Now, what I need to do is I have to... I want to... Let me see how am I going to do this I need to take this away and this away 
And I need to grab... You. And put... You back in place underneath. So you should be receiving power again. No. Why not? You should be getting power. Or if you... No. Why? I am not happy. There is no reason for you to be doing that to me. You cheeky little monkey. Okay, so maybe it would have worked. So right now it's not running because it's got no power. It's got no way to get rid of stuff. All right, let's do it this way again. Do that. I want to take, I can't take you off that way. What I need to do is I need to get a trash can with a filter set up to have it automatically dump those bits into the... Um, into the trash. So I want a... I want you right there. Oh no. Why not? Our uh, rut row. Is that not going to work? Are you kidding me? Nope. Alright, I got to figure out how to do this. I will be right back. Okay, this is what I figured out. I think, and I'm reasonably certain on this one, other than showing you this, I put in my item filter into the trash can and I put a blacklist filter for stone and cobblestone onto the reinforced filter that's going into the compact chest. This is turned on. What I think happened was when I interrupted the quarry from the power supply down below, it uh, kind of went, okay, you don't want me to play that. I'm just going to forget everything you told me and wanted me to do before. So now I need to do another setup of the, whoop, wrong way, of the um, ender markers. So we come down here, unless it's already running and I just failed to recognize that fact. Um, oh, I need silk touch there. And it is mining, but it has no power. That doesn't make sense. Okay, I don't want to play. You go away. Um, hmm. All right, so it is being a butthead. I think I may have to. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to pull it out and do it again. So, let's just do that. All right. Unable to detect. Put that back. Back over here. Put that back. And that's seeing each other. Good. And then that one sees that one. Good. And establishing boundary. And why are you not getting power? Mining at. Okay. I am not seeing results. Why am I not seeing results? You're receiving energy and you're sending items. And you are not doing what you're supposed to do. You are not working. Okay, so why? All right, let's continue to figure this out. I will be right back. This is very strange. First of all, I'm on frequency three here, but Wayla up there says it's on frequency zero. Uh, and that is just slightly bothersome because it shouldn't be on frequency zero. It should be on frequency three. And everything else seems to be set correctly. So let's go check it out again. Unless I'm missing something, which I don't think I am. 
Anything's possible, though. All right, so... And I went over here and checked this one. This is set correctly. Uh, we're on power. It is receiving items only. And it is ignoring redstone signal. So that should all be working fantastic. And then down here... We are... Drip and 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 drip. There we go. All right. So that is on send items, receive energy, and now it has power. All right. So now you are probably also. Oh, it has restarted. It's going through its thing again. Um, what are you doing? Are you mining at good? So it is good. I should start seeing stuff pop in here again. Oh, you know what? It's probably sending them through there. Over to the other side. So let's go ahead and throw that on there. Turn that off and let it dump everything. And now let's go home and see if stuff is actually piling up like it's supposed to be. Oop. And... Dun, dun, dun! Okay, that's all working like it's supposed to. And I'm not seeing anything coming through that pipe. You know what I'm thinking the problem is? And it just occurred to me. I may need... <laughs> Somebody else is already saying this out loud. Um, I need a chunk loader. Because... The... Yeah, my base and my reactor are not loading when I'm in the other area. So, let's go the... Well, that's ugly. Let's go that route. Don't have enough. Go that route. Still don't have enough. What's the only difference? No real difference. I need to make some Pesseracs and stuff. So, I will be right back. Matter of fact, I'm just going to go ahead and wrap this up. Thank you very much for watching. I'm going to make the Tesseracts uh, on the other side. And again, hope you're having a fantastic day. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit the dislike button, or tell me what you, what you want to see. Have yourself a good one.